This is problem number five from the June 2014 Algebra Regents exam. Uh, this question is fairly straightforward. We simply need to solve this equation and find out the value of x. I'm going to start by uh, distributing the 7 thirds and multiplying it into the brackets here. So we'd get 7 over 3x plus, oh, I'm just going to do the, the math here on the side. Uh, so we need to do 7 thirds times 9 over 28. Um, we can make that become a 3, so it's 21 over 28. equals 20. Now, uh, 21 over 28, we can simplify. Uh, if we divide both of these by 7, we would get 3 quarters instead. Okay, so what, we're gonna, what I'm going to do now is multiply every term here by 12. And the reason I'm doing that is to make these uh, fractions disappear. And I picked 12 because that is the lowest common multiple of 3 and 4. Um, okay, so uh, if we multiply these guys here, so tw uh, that becomes 1, this becomes a 4. So we'd have 28x, and then that becomes a 1, the 12 would become a 3. So it's plus 9, and 20 times 12 is 240. Okay, moving on up here, so we've got 28x, oops, plus 9 equals 240. Next, we can uh, subtract 9 from both sides, and we'll get 28x equals 231. And then to finish off, we would divide both sides here by 28. And if you calculate that, we get an answer of 8. 0.25, which is option number one. Okay, I hope that was helpful, and thanks for visiting JD's Regents Preparation.